Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Here's how to take snapshots or screenshots in the VLC player. So this is really useful if you're watching a movie, if you're watching a video, and you want to take a quick screenshot of a funny moment and you want to send it to someone. So we'll go over how to take the screenshot and then how to find it, and then you can share it to anyone you want to. So first of all, open up the VLC player, and then to take a screenshot while you're watching a movie, on this top bar, click on to video, and then click on take snapshot. This snapshot will then be saved on your PC. Usually it'll just be saved to the my documents and then my pictures on your file explorer. So this would be right here. So you go onto your file explorer, then you can go onto this PC right here, then go onto documents and then look for my pictures. And then it'll be saved right there, usually. Now another way of taking the screenshot is either t pressing shift and s on your keyboard if you're on windows if you're on mac it's command alt and s so two, two different versions depending on if you're on mac os or if you're on windows and now if you want to change where the file is saved maybe you want to change the format you can do this all right here so just click onto tools go onto preferences and go onto video and now you can see here video snapshots so you can change the format png jpeg or tiff you can change that here right here and you can save to where it will be saved so if you want to change the directory then just click on browse and now you can select anything right here so you can for example go on to pictures here and then go on to screenshots or maybe you can make a separate folder for your vlc screenshots so yeah this is where you can change that then just hit save down here and then you're good to go so yeah, now you know how to take a screenshot in the VLC player and where it's safe, so you can share it to family, friends, whoever you want to. I hope this helped you out. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe if it did, and comment down below if you have any more questions.